People who move out to the west and start teaching in these rural areas love it. Most of the time we have people who stay for a number of years because they really enjoy the lifestyle out here and they also enjoy being part of a community. Um, we're all a long way away from our families so we all become family for each other and it's the people that you'll miss when you leave because the people out here are fantastic. Don't wait for an invitation, get involved and there's a thousand things that you could be doing and um, everyone's really welcoming and would just love to have you out here and involved. My experience in Mount Isa has been really good. I've been welcomed with open arms by both community, parents, staff, kids. Um, it's just a lovely place to be actually and everyone, because everyone's in the same position of being away, they know what it's like when you're, when you're away from everyone. So yeah, they really make a huge effort and it's quite nice. The moment I got out here I've, I felt more than welcome. Um, the support given by all my colleagues and all the people of the town, is everyone's friendly and, and invites you to whatever event's on and, and there's always plenty of events on and I've always felt supported while I've been out here so it's been really great. A lot of our recruits are, are graduates and, and very newly graduated teachers so they're not only coming to terms with the teaching profession but also with the, the township in Cloncurry and uh, being remote and most of them come from the coast so that's often a challenge as well, but it's a challenge that we, uh, we seem to be handling very well because our teachers not only stay for their two years, but they'll stay for another two on top of that, So, um, which is wonderful to see that they, they grow with the school and, and they um, share their expertise. This has certainly been a positive start to my teaching career. Since starting here, I wasn't very confident in ICTs and since coming out west, we have so many We've got iPads and we've got um, computers. We're getting new Chromebooks as well sent through from Townsville and um, I've taken a, a bit of a leadership role in that sense um, and I've really become quite passionate about ICTs. So within my classroom we do a lot of online stuff and submitting things online and um, using different Web2 tools. We're getting each class into those sorts of things as well which is really nice. Living in Mount Isa has been absolutely wonderful. Um, ma amazing opportunities, um, the scenery is spectacular. I would describe the Western community as being incredibly friendly, um, amazingly open to new challenges. Um, the kids want to learn, the people want to meet you, the people are friendly, um, and it's just, it's brilliant. So coming from a suburban Melbourne school, I wasn't sure about um, the facilities and the resources available here at a, a school in far west Queensland, but um, it's at an equal, if not um, better, in terms of my ICT role. Um, the kids, as you can see behind me, um, are working on their Chromebooks. So we have one-to-one -one Chromebook laptops in our Year 7 class, and um, our principal's always been a big fan of whatever they can have on the coast. Um, we're equally um, able to have that at our school here, which is definitely the case. The four Catholic schools uh, in Mount Isa and Cloncurry work very closely together to ensure that each teacher experiences transformation in their teaching. Mount Isa is a great place for opportunities for sport and the arts. Mount Isa had a long history, for example, of rugby league and dominating in North Queensland. Do Aussie Rules Friday night, rugby league uh, Saturday, you know, and then you can do soccer on Sunday. So you can do lots of things. Uh, because it's only five minutes to everywhere and people belong to so many associations here. The parish also offers an opportunity, especially for young people uh, coming here as young teachers, uh, to be involved in some of our social programs. For example, um, some of our young teachers cook the meals on Saturday and Sunday that we have uh, for uh, people who are homeless and uh, they can get involved in all sorts of social programs out here, which are normally uh, probably don't even exist in most parishes in Australia. I think for young teachers, uh, working out here is wonderful for their, um, their careers. I think it really establishes some strong bases in, in, in their teaching, um, but also just uh, gives them a real well-rounded um, aspect to teaching as well in terms of uh, in being involved in the community life. The best way to describe Cloncurry is that it is a welcoming place. Uh, the social aspect is, is uh, a wonderful uh, attribute for, for any families moving and the school St Joseph's School is a big part of our community in Cloncurry and vice versa, the Cloncurry community is a big part of our school. I encourage all new teachers and young teachers to come out to the West. I think that they will find the schools out here are very similar to what they have experienced on the coast and I encourage them to experience the opportunities that the West has to offer for themselves. Mm -hmm.